a lot of people will look at this and they will immediately start putting Jimmy Garoppolo in New England. People have wanted to put Jimmy Garoppolo in New England since the beginning of this process and they will see San Francisco aggressively trading up for a quarterback and they will see that as the first step toward that. Should we be now on the lookout for Bill Belichick to make some kind of move to bring Jimmy G back to Foxborough? Greeny, this offseason has taught us that everything and anything is possible and on the table. I think whether, you know, whether the Patriots at this very moment are trying to work out a trade, I don't know. But here's the thing. We have a month until the draft, and really everything's on the table because no one in the league believes Jimmy G is their long-term guy. Like the 49ers at some point, yes, they have to say that. We know that this is smokescreen season. We understand that the NFL execs can't say exactly what they think regarding their own teams. And you're not going to – if you're the Jets, you're going to say Sam Darnold is great. You're going to say we love Sam Darnold. So many teams want him. If you're the 49ers, you're going to say, we love Jimmy. He is our guy this year. But every other team knows, like, okay, at some point they're going to move on. And can we put together an enticing enough package that allows us to get him? What do you think, Danny? If, if you're, why are you, why are you doing that? Well, I think first of all, is Jimmy G done in San Francisco? It depends on who they draft. If they draft Mac Jones, he's gone. If they draft Trey Lance, I could see them keeping Jimmy Garoppolo until Trey Lance is ready. That being said, Jimmy Garoppolo has missed 23 games in the last three years. Okay, if we are going to hold Carson Wentz to the fire for missing games and lack of dependability or availability, we've got to do the same thing for Jimmy Garoppolo. In the last three years, he's got the third worst interception percentage in the NFL. If we are going to continuously kill Jameis Winston for turnovers, we've got to do the same thing for Jimmy Garoppolo. So I don't think the Patriots are like, oh my goodness, Jimmy Garoppolo could be available. He's missed 23 games the last three years. He throws too many interceptions. So I get it. It's like, like, uh, there's, there's this aura because he came from them, but are they, were they beating down the door to go get Carson Wentz or Jameis Winston? No. So I don't think the Patriots will or should be beating down the door to, do, the door to go get Jimmy Garoppolo. Go ahead, Nick. Yeah, you're absolutely right. And also, the team who currently has him has traded away just about Good everything point. to get away from him. So, like, that would give me a little trepidation also. Like, they gave up their whole future because they think they can win now with somebody who is not that guy. So, I don't think that there is a clamoring to get Jimmy Garoppolo back to New England or anywhere else for that matter. Maybe somewhere like Denver where they feel like that, that – uh, just having anybody as an upgrade over Drew Locke, but I, I don't see Jimmy Jimmy G moving for uh, going back to New England for anything sizable. If they if they're gonna willing to move Jimmy G for a fourth round pick, maybe they do it. But then if I'm uh, San Francisco, I'm like, nah, we'll just keep him for that. So uh, let me finish this up with you, Mike Tannenbaum. Again, I will point out that you are a man who has saunered in your life with Bill Belichick. There doesn't have to be a clamoring <laughs> for Jimmy G in New England. There just has to be one person right. who believes in him. And everything I've <laughs> ever heard is that Belichick loves Garoppolo. So uh, Mike Tannenbaum, knowing them as you know them, what should we expect? Yeah, and I disagree with what Dan said. The chessboards change. Coach Belichick's going to see it. They have to go get Jimmy Garoppolo because right now – it's Jared Stidham, Cam Newton, or is Jimmy Garoppolo the best chance to give us a chance to win this year because they can't get up for these quarterbacks. The quarterback draft's going to be over by the time we get to eight at the Lays with Carolina, and I think they'll trade up as well. So if I'm Coach Belichick and I'm watching everything unfold, Jimmy Garoppolo is probably going to give him the best chance. I, I understand the injuries and the turnovers, but... Is he better than Cam Newton and Jared Stidham in 2021? And that's the question they're going to answer in Foxborough. And I believe they'll try to get uh, Jimmy G back to them. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.